How would you respond to a Mormon that claims that they believe in the same Jesus that Christians do? After all, they may make the claim that their church is entitled the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. They'll say, we put the name of Jesus on the forefront of our church. Of course we believe in who he is. We believe in the same guy. Well, for this topic on terminology, we want to break down just what Mormons actually believe about who Jesus is. The key to addressing this with Mormons is to ask them who they personally believe Jesus is by their own definition. Oftentimes when you do this, you'll start to get answers about who he was at his origin, meaning Jesus wasn't actually the Son of God being one with the Father. He is rather a physical being, according to their definition of who he is. You'll come to find that Mormons have this difference where they believe that Jesus was the physical, spiritual brother of both us as human beings and Lucifer, the devil himself, which is also contrary to what the Bible teaches. We come to find that Mormons have a drastically different view of who Jesus is than Christians do. In John 1, 1 through 5, it says, In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was in the beginning with God, and all things were made through him, and without him not anything was made that was made. In him was life, and life, and the life was the light of man. The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. So through that passage alone, as well as many other passages, we can see that Jesus is one with the Father. They don't be, Mormons don't believe in the Trinity of being the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Rather, they just believe in one God and then the Son being a physical brother to you and I spiritually from heaven. And so when you break down these questions, uh, just keep asking for Mormons to define what they mean when they talk about resurrection, crucifixion, and then sanctification. Because when you start to break down these terms about who Jesus is, you start to get a drastically different answer than the Christian idea. And thank you for listening to this topic on terminology. Uh, we hope that this has now left you confident in your faith on how to talk to Mormons about who the true Jesus is and break down those terms for an accurate definition.